welcome back to another mail video. I know it's a different setting again, but you know, it is it is what it is. We'll get back to our usual toy setting in a little while. But I did get another letter in my P.O. box all the way from Russia. All the way from Russia. It says, I came all the way from Russia, which is really, really cool. And it just like really brings everything together. And it's like, you guys watch from all over the place. And it's so exciting. So this one is from Kristen, it looks like. I hope that's your name. I think it's Kristen. Before we get into opening this letter, I want to say you can send me mail if you want to. It's listed on oclucktoys.com in the sending mail tab. My address is listed there and all the rules and everything. Wow, it got really bright. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know why, why the camera's like really super bright right now. But anyway, follow the rules, check with your parents if you want to send me mail. Anyway, the sun just went in. The sun keeps going in and out, so it's just gonna keep doing that. So anyway, let's go ahead and get this open. It has cute little stickers on the outside, but I don't wanna show you the front because it has our address on it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get open. I do open all mail on camera unless you state otherwise. So, whoa, stickers! <gasps> They're little chicken stickers, you guys! Oh my gosh, can you see? So this one's a little chick hatching out of an egg, and this one's a little hen in a nest. Oh my gosh, it's so cute, thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. It's just a chick. Yeah, just a little chicky. And I'm definitely gonna be using those for sure. Let's see, are there any more stickers in here? I think that's it. Anyway, thank you for sending this, by the way. I really, really appreciate it. So, ooh, what are these? What's this going on? What's this? Ooh, oh. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's read the letter. It looks like it's a... It's a long, okay, it says do not read on camera. So, let me just read this really quick. Wait, what, how, which part don't I read on camera? Okay, wait, oh wait, there are chicken stickers inside. Yes, I got that. Um, I'm assuming not to read this on camera. I will read it now, and then if it's cool, I could answer the questions here on on this video so let me go ahead and answer the questions if that i hope that's okay with you let me make sure it is so i just read your letter kristen i really really appreciate it thank you so much i'm not obviously not going to read it on camera i do want to answer the questions just a little bit on camera and just to, just to make this video i will write you back though i will i promise uh, it might take a little bit. I, this video will definitely go out way before you actually get the letter, but I will I will try my best. I'm super busy right now, but I will get back to it, I promise. Uh, but Kristen was super kind enough to send me like a little card and then it's there's like Russian. You can't see it, but like now I, can, I have something in Russian from Russia, oh my gosh. And then there's a picture, a picture, a Polaroid. This is really awesome, thank you so much. This is so amazing that you know you took this picture and then it's like here in existence with me right now. I think that's just so cool. Anyway, uh, your first question was why did you become vegan? And you did ask uh, more in detail and I will write to you about that obviously, but just briefly, I became a vegan because, well, one, one thing that really pushed me, my sister was already vegetarian. I had promised myself that, like she had introduced me to the world and I was on Vine one day and I saw chicks in, we're not gonna get into it because it's a toy channel, but it's it was like really graphic and it really hit me. And uh, I was like, okay, at the end of the year for my New Year's resolution, I'm gonna become become a vegetarian, and then halfway through the year, I'll go to veganism. Uh, I got really sick, like not not ill. It, like I just didn't feel good ever. I had stomach aches all the time, headaches, back aches. Like I was just achy. I felt overall gross. So. I was like, well, it's time to change. It's time to change. It has to be what I eat. I, I, I do what I can. So I did that. I did it for the animals, but I did it earlier for myself, for my health. I, ever since changing, I have felt 10,000%. Uh, well, that's a lie. Like, I felt like a million bajillion percent better. Um, but I stick to it, not only because it makes me feel great, but I have, during my journey to veganism, I have learned to appreciate animals a lot more. I, all my life I've worked with animals, I've worked at pet stores, I've, I've, I've rehabilitated animals, but this, this in particular, like I loved animals, I always did, 
but I'd never really realized what was going on and this made me love animals so so much more and I feel for them and I could go on and on and on and on for days and I know you guys don't really want to hear about it some of you guys probably don't want to hear about it but I will write to you more about it and it's just it's just it's just great I feel great I do I generally feel great um, when and how did you start collecting toys? I started collecting toys, oh gosh, I don't know. I mean, I've always kind of had toys. Um, I was a big car collector. Um, cars, dolls, I was like mixed because my dad was into NASCAR, so he'd always give me, buy me um, die cast cars and I'd always play them in the sand or something. And uh, that's, I mean, I've always kind of liked that. And then I got re into it. Like I started this channel, I did a lot more because of plush Tsum Tsums, when they were a thing. I saw them on Instagram, I was like, oh my gosh, what is that, I need it. And I bought every one that was available on DisneyStore.com and found out that people actually make videos of them. And then I was like, whoa, and then I just spiraled into this whole toy thing. <laughs> and I do like dolls, I used to have an, oh, what my parents called an American Girl doll and they convinced me that it was, but I think it was some like Dollar Tree doll. Like it was the size of an American Girl doll, but the hair was disgusting, it was just absolutely gross. Anyway. Again, I'll write to you more about this. Uh, do uh, do you have an American Girl doll? No, I don't. Not now. I <laughs> I'm too cheap to buy one. I mean, I'll probably get one. Our generation, I do have. Um, but yeah, I do have two our generation dolls. I do have a Wally Wisher. Does that count as an American Girl doll? I think it does, but uh, I will write back to you. I think I will. Do I still have your address? Yes, I will write back to you. Um, thank you so, 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 so much for sending this. I really appreciate it. I love the picture. I love the letter. I love the kind words. It's really nice hearing from you. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up for Kristen for this awesome letter. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye. Thank you so much for watching the video. Check out some of my other videos and make sure you subscribe to my channel for new videos every day. Also, did you know that I have two other channels? Check out my gaming and my vlog channel. And don't forget to follow me on social media. See you guys next time. Bye.